Hello friends, this is Umesh and today we are going to create this model. This is an axial radial rotor and here if you will see I have one front view and one section view AA which is this one. Okay, so blade is on the left side of this section and angle is given here or you can divide it equally at 360 degree okay so first of all I am going to start with the section view half section view I am going to create and I will use revolve command to make it solid okay come to this home and from sketch select the plane and here I am starting with this click and after this and the gap is near about 18 so first I'm just defining this value it is 18 right now I will get the approximate 15 this one is 15 so half of 15 is 7.5 and this axis and point both are constants right now use this profile and now from this a little bit here and come to this small value is there again up and here now arc use this arc and like this again from here one more arc and if you will see one smaller arc is also there so I am using this tangential arc here and uh, okay that's it now uh, this 21 this value is 21 so select this and this so half of 21 10.5 and the total is the total of is for this one so before this I am assigning this radius 16 this 16 radius this is from this to this point this given is 16 right and the gap is 2 so from this and this gap is 2 and anything else pick it and drag and drag this now the radius for this one is given as 45.5 and this one is 45 radius close and drag this okay now drag this okay now I'm going to match this one so gap is given as the outer is 100 so from this to this point it this is 50 no it is not properly so drag it so that it will come proper now select this point and this point make them <coughs> align right and now for this one I'm using arc and from this to a little bit here and I'm trying to match and this is 1.5 this is given 1.5 radius 1.5 is a radius right okay and uh, make them tangential it is already tangent now second gap is 98 so select this at this end point and 98 divided by 2 close let's see okay and select this point and this point align All right and the gap 
is so make them consonant and this gap is one so I will align the same gap on this top so use this point and this point the gap is one no something is wrong so first undo it so this gap is 1 mm again I'm trying this 1.0 and still it is not coming properly see the shape is not proper undo and before assigning this I'm going to assign this 21 so click this from here to this lower point gap is given as 21 the total height right now I'm changing this value to 1 now it is okay close the sketch is fully constrained and I'm closing this so this section is now ready now finish and use this revolve and reason bounding surface this reason and this reason I want to revolve and my axis is this Y and OK and see on this top the radius is 2 so 2 click here OK right and uh, anything, anything else mm, no everything is OK I hope so here I need one fillet so at the last we will create okay now I'm going to create this one so click and select the same plane right now use this and I'm starting from here a little bit here and taper and straight come inside now from this project curve select single curve and I am going to select this and this okay now dimension it click here the dimension is given 61.7 is a radius so from this this last is given as 61.7 and 8 this gap is 8 and for chamfer the 10 is given so select this line and this gap is 10 okay still the total height is remain so it is a little bit down so 20 this gap is 20 from this to this it is 20 and you stream I don't want this and this one also okay cancel my sketch is fully defined now finish and come to this extrude selecting this but it is not selecting reason is this one and here it is gap is 1 this one why the radius is given 0.5 so double of 0.5 is 1 add this double click over it and select unite and see whether it is joining or not no it is not joining the tool is completely outside this warning is coming so keep it none and use this fillet and here 0.5 is a radius 0 0.5 select this select this apply and for this and this apply now the shape is complete ok now come to this and hide this and uh, because this is completely outside ok so what I am going to do first I will pattern then I will 
use offset face so that I can assign hold the control key and select these two fill it and number of instances are 7 at 360 degree now it is uniformly here right and uh, add this sketch and hide this one also now rotate it and from here I'm using offset reason and tangential face click this face this this one this and thickness 0 0.2 okay take a little bit so that it will merge with the revolve object right now combine I'm using this unite base object and then all other solid parts okay and here assign the fillet click apply right and here I need this one and this shape is this radius is 6 is given and uh, it is face blend so I'm selecting single face is this and arrow inside again second face this one arrow inside and the radius is 6 okay this will come right now this model is complete so if you have any query you can comment me you can message me thank you for watching and for better view I am using this shading right